make sure you're actually recording this time. What's going on my awesome movie nerds? Today is an exciting day. I got this package in the mail today. This is from one of you guys, from one of my subscribers. Huge shout out to Chill Rob G. Thank you so much for sending this to me, man. He, he messaged me. He says, hey, I've got a box of DVDs that I've upgraded to Blu-ray. Could I send them to you? I said, shoot, yes, send them on over. And I am super excited to be opening this up again. Huge, huge thank you, Chill Rob G. Very much appreciate you sending this over to me. We're going to pop this open and uh, we're going to see what's inside here, guys. All right, here we go. Oh, okay. Uh, a card. Thank you. I will. I will pop this open and uh, and read it. Read it in a bit here. Okay. We have to address the alien, the alien in the room. Look at this guy. There we go. That's super, super, super cool. There. All right. There we go. So I'm just gonna grab a stack here. Go, go through it. Is anybody there? It's got Michael Caine in it. Michael Caine's always great. I've not, I've not heard of this. So that's going to be fun, fun to check out there. Rent. I have not, not seen this. I mean, I've, I've heard a lot about it. So I'm, I'm excited. To check that out. That's cool. That's cool. We've got Billy Elliot. Very interesting. One of the best films of the year. Very funny, apparently. So that's cool. We've got uh, Far From Heaven. Far From Heaven. We've got Dennis Quaid, Julian Moore. Four Academy Award nominations, including Best Actress. So that should be a fairly good one, uh, I would think. All right. Perks of Being a Wallflower. This is one of my favorite films of all time. I love this movie. I do already have this. I, I will see if I can't send this along to someone else. I love Perks. We got Chicago here. I actually, I, uh, I have this one as well. But, ooh, Fargo. I've heard a lot about this. I have not, not yet seen it. Insomnia. This, one of those old Warner Brothers snap cases. <laughs> That's great. That's great. This has got Al Pacino, Robin Williams. That's cool. Very cool. We will continue on here. I Huckabees. Austin from the future editing here, it's called I Heart Huckabees. It's a little heart emoji in there. I, I did not realize. So, um, <clears throat> back to the video. Yes. Interesting. Dustin Hoffman. Jude Law. I love that guy. Jason Schwartzman. Mark Wahlberg. All right. Naomi Watts. We've got, a, we've got a few stars in there. Got a few stars. Children of Men. Yeah, another one. You're 20, it's 27. Ooh. Last days of the human race. I hope that's not true, because that's seven years away. <laughs> I, 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 I feel like I've definitely heard of this before. Ooh. The Most Dangerous Game. This is a 1932 movie. This is super cool. That's neat. All right, Criterion Collection, wow. The Astronaut's Wife. Interesting, another one of those snap cases. This has got Johnny Depp and uh, Charlie Theron. There, gosh, butchered, butchered that. But uh, yeah, another one of these snap cases, uh, old Warner Brothers snap cases. That's cool, that's cool. All right, continuing on. Three days of condor? Three days of condor here. It's got, uh, let's see, Robert Redford. Very cool. Very cool. 1975 movie. Ah! Here we go. Da -da. Da -da. <laughs> we got Jaws here. I do actually have, have Jaws. Um, but uh, that's cool. That's cool. Platoon. So, so that's... I've not heard of that. That looks interesting. <laughs> hairspray. I, I, I have heard of Hairspray. 
trying to remember what exactly. I feel like I've seen seen footage and stuff about it. But uh, anyway, that's cool. That's cool right there. Alrighty, we've got Serial Mom, another one of these Warner Brothers snap case. I love it. I love it. That's cool. Ooh, Sleepy Hollow. This has got Johnny Depp, uh, Johnny Depp in it. That looks, that looks cool. From Dusk Till Dawn, Collector's Series. This, this looks good. What year? I want to, I want to find the year of the release. I don't, I don't see it. This, that looks interesting. Romancing the Stone? I, I like the packaging on here. I've not heard of this. Wonder Boys. Very interesting. Michael Douglas, Tobey Maguire, Katie Holmes, Robert Downey Jr. So we've got uh, we got some stars in there. Should, uh, this should be interesting. Very cool, very cool. All right, we've actually gone through uh, one, one stack here. And there's surprisingly very few movies uh, that I actually already have, which is super awesome. All right, moving on. Ooh, we've got Goodfellas. Actually, I, th I I'm not sure if I have this or not. I don't think I do. I don't think I do. This is actually one I would have to check. See, another one of those snap cases. This Boy's Life. We got it. This Boy's Life with Robert De Niro, Leonardo DiCaprio. Ooh, interesting. Alan Barkin. Hmm. Very cool. Very cool. Another one of those Warner Brothers. <gasps> no way! <laughs> the Big Lebowski. This is one that I've been trying to find at like thrift stores and stuff because I don't want to spend too much on it. This is awesome. I've been wanting to see this for quite some time now. And uh, this, that's cool. That's cool. One of my, one of my more favorite finds in this. So, uh, we've got... The Motel Life? That's an, actually, I, I like that title. Dakota Fanning, Chris Christopherson. Anywho, I, I, that's a very interesting title. I feel like this could be a really good one. I do, I do. All right. Um, Glenn Glary Glenn Ross? 10 year anniversary special edition. I've not heard of this. Very interesting, very very interesting. I should really start restacking these back in there. All right, here we go. Ooh, this one. Judy Garland and James Mason. A Star is Born. Very cool. Wait. Is this... Is this like the... Uh, what was the film that, uh, that, 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 that Lady Gaga did? That's what this is. I think uh, I think that was a remake of it. Anyhow, or the Lady Gaga was a remake of that. L.A. Confidential. I feel like I've, I've definitely heard of this. Yes, Kevin Spacey, Russell Crowe, Guy Pearce, Danny DeVito, Kim Basinger. Missing. Anyhow, L.A. Confidential. That should be good. Should be good. Penny Dreadful. Oh, this is a TV series. Complete first and second season. Very interesting. Ooh. It's a Showtime TV series, Penny Dreadful. That's cool. I've not heard of this. That's 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 cool to find TV series in here. Zombieland. Oh, this is this is such a hilarious film. This is actually one I have on my list to be watching this month, the month of October. Uh, for my for my fun Halloween stuff, so uh, I do have this, but still, that is a great film here. Jeepers Creepers two, Jeepers Creepers. What a, a, a unique sounding title. I like that. Jeepers Creepers. That looks interesting. Dreamcatcher. Interesting. We've got Morgan Freeman in here. Donnie Wahlberg. So that looks interesting. Wow, all right. As we continue, Escape from New York. This is like, look at this case, guys. DVD collector's set. Escape from New York, DVD collector's set. 
Look at that. Wow. Very, very cool. Alright. 30 Days of Night. It's another interesting sounding title. It looks interesting. <laughs> Pitch Black. It's hip, sexy, and scary as hell. So, <laughs> not sure what I'm going to be getting into here. And then Eyes of Laura Mar. So, it's got Tommy Lee Jones in it. That's cool. Very interesting. Very, very interesting. Wow. Like I said, a surprisingly large amount here. I, I, I kind of thought that there might be, because he said there's a few that I probably, or might possibly own already. Um, but there's surprisingly very few in here. Freddy vs. Jason. I have never, I've never seen any of the uh, Nightmare on Elm Street films, or is it the, which one is Freddy in? No, Freddy is five, the um, Elm Street. Jason, who's, which one I'm trying to remember? Because you have the, the Halloween, Friday the 13th. That's Jason, isn't it? There we go. I, I hope that's right. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm, I'm going to look like a fool. Don't look like a dang fool. Uh, I've never seen, though, any either Nightmare on Elm Street or Friday the 13th, any of them. What, what if that's the first first one that introduces me to both of those characters? That sounds like a good idea. John Carpenter's The Thing. I have heard of this. Ooh. Ooh, yes. This, uh, this looks good. I'm excited to check that out. Prince. John Carpenter's Prince of Darkness. Interesting. Interesting. All right, I'm getting I'm getting into a lot of cool horror stuff to be watching this month. That is super fun. Well, thank you very much, sir. We've got Halloween. Oh yes, both of uh, we've got Halloween and Halloween Two. So this is gonna get me a nice good start on that Halloween uh, franchise there. And Christine, John Carpenter's. Christine. So, super dope, super awesome, super cool here. Last but not least here we have Birth. This looks interesting. It's got Nicole Kidman. I love Nicole Kidman. One of my favorite actresses right there. Super cool. So, once again, thank you Chill Rob G and thank all of you guys for watching this video, for supporting this channel in any and every way that you do. Like the video, because it super helps me out. Comment below which one of these films is, is your favorite, I guess. Do something like that. Comments super help out, and you know what helps out? The subscriptions. So be sure to subscribe, be sure to uh, to do the do the subscribing and the bell notificationings and all that jazz. And remember guys, I love you awesome nerds. See you in the next one. Peace!